And that was one of my solutions, by the way, is to, okay, how am I going to get in common with everybody? How am I going to work with everyone? How, how, how am I going to let them know that I'm not an adversary? I'm not um, uh, competing with them, you know? Okay, first thing I got to do is get in calm, universal solvent. Conventions. We had a first convention in uh, Prescott. It was about 12 of us. <laughs> and somebody showed up with some money, and we put it up in, in uh, Las Vegas, right? Uh, there was um, more than 60 people there in Las Vegas. People seem to like the Las Vegas, remember? <laughs> um, but anyway, we've been doing it for seven years. And then last year, what we did is um, uh, I opened it up and I said to the group, I said, and most of you weren't here, I weren't in that convention, but I said, who wants to do it next year? And these two folks now stood up. So I want to acknowledge David, Aida. And, and also their daughter back there, who's been working hard, uh, Gwendolyn. Uh, uh, this, is, this is a family affair, because uh, my daughter and my wife have been helping me in the last seven years, so you guys give them a hand, too. <laughs> so all of a sudden, I feel more united, right? We're, we're a group here. Okay, so... Um, See how I am reading this off, trying to stay with this thing? You don't need to hear that one. Yeah. Okay, so the two the two main the three main solutions here to this problem of of us all being uh, scattered. Was, um, was to investigate what is really standard tech or not. What, what is really going on? You know, how come, because I, I get in calm with somebody and they start arguing with me. Um, <laughs> I had one class A come over and he was literally foaming at the mouth, you know. Um, <laughs> so one, one thing is um, knowledge. You know, knowledge is a uh, endpoint for the KRC triangle, correct? Knowledge. And then you got responsibility as cause, and then you got control, right? So I wanted more. I wanted more control on this thing. You know, it's like I wanted more knowledge. Uh, in in the superpower tech, we found that the KRC triangle equals. What does it equal? Those who've done superpower with me, power, yeah. KRC triangle equals understanding, right? So we got to get empowered, guys. We got to get empowered. So I got I got three solutions to how to unite the free zone, and eventually, those poor guys at the church. Uh, <laughs> okay, the first thing is I, I I dug into this information up here. Do you have I have on the wall? And I'll go over real briefly on this. Um, uh, I could spend, I mean, you could spend hours and hours on this up here, but we're not going to do it because we don't have time. Um, and um, I don't have the patience today. Got any more cord? Is that it? All right, the first one. And it, it, you see, it, the church put this out last year. It, it, it was like uh, I needed the first, talk about postulates, I needed the first gradation chart, and lo and behold, thank you, David Miscavige, and he put out the first gradation chart with a movie, with a video. Did anybody see that? Yeah, there was a video, 1960, gradation chart, they're sending it to their public, and it was like Elrich standing up there talking about the gradation chart. I'll give you guys a copy, anybody wants one. And this is it over here. 1960, and he talks about clear, and I'm going to go, that's my second solution, is what is clear. You're going to love it. Nobody here is going to be mad at me, I, I really hope not anyway. Um, they usually get mad at me when I start talking about clear, you know, I, I, I handled it though. Um, the first one here, he has the, the zero to four, and then he has um, power processes in grade, um, up to grade uh, clearing course, 
and then he stops there on, on seven. <clears throat> then, years later, he has the Great Eastern chart and awareness chart, um, 1970, where he put OT levels up here. He put OT levels. But, um, so there were, the, there were the expansion of this was here. Now, I did these OT levels back in the 70s, all the way up to seven. And I was doing them and I realized that these processes were actually evolved or done out of creation human ability and so forth back here in 52. Let's see. So this, did this guy have all the tech already and he's just doing this? I don't know, you know, it was strange. But anyway, um, but there was of course no OT8 at the time. And uh, this was a good chart. I got trained under that chart. And five years later, he, this other chart comes out where um, there's some shifts in the OT levels. I won't go into them. Though they're, they're, they're purposely done. Um, expanded grade 0 to 4. They put quads in. the so zero flow, self to self. And um, uh, I was told that Otto Roos helped put this together. Somebody else told me today, Raymond, said that Otto Roos did 70. I don't, I don't know that we have to check that out, <laughs> confirm that. Um, this is 60, 70, 75. 65, no, it's 60, 70, 75. 65 Where? You're right, it was 65, right. There was none in 60, you're right. This is the first one. Okay, lucky I don't have Surfax. <laughs> uh, you grade four auditors know what I'm talking about. Yeah, I, I, you know, I, that when I heard that, uh, the, that you could have Surfax and, and other dynamics, I quickly grabbed Leslie and, and ran all my surfax and all my dynamics, so I don't, I don't make her wrong anymore. <laughs> anyway, <clears throat> so he got 75 here. Um, I was trained in 72, I was on the briefing course, so like there was this transition here, but I finished the OT levels at 75, and 79 I um, attested to, I still have my certs, I tested to uh, completion, full completion, 19027. Um, and, um, and then when knots came out, we have this one here. But there, there's another one here that I don't have. It's right between here. This is 1978. And knots, you guys are familiar with knots, right? Knots was first put un after OT4. And then in 1980, it was put up here. Now, uh, I feel, and I try to do it in our center after OT4. This is the original knots developed by LRH and David Mayo. We don't do RTC knots at our center. Okay, so uh, because David himself told me, and I had a meeting with Dave, uh, I had a couple, I, had, I, met, I knew Dave Mayo, uh, I met him three times. One, I did an internship under him. Um, uh, what was it, Happiness Rundown? Anybody do that? Yeah. Happens run down. Oh, great. Uh, and Leslie back there. Yeah. Um, so, and then the next two times I met him was in the free zone. And uh, the last time we sat and had a beer. And uh, he told me a lot of stuff. <laughs> I keep giving him beers. You know? <laughs> <laughs> 